Hello YouTubers, I am Parwiz and this is our 12th video in Python QB. So in this video we're going to talk uh, about creating a pop-up uh, in QB. So if you want this, uh, to get the source codes, uh, you can just uh, check my blog and you can get the source code from here. Now uh, I've already created two Py uh, so Python file, now uh, a Python file and also a QB file. So first let me just write uh, my Python file. Uh, first I'm going to just from kv.app I'm going to import app and also from uh, kv.uix.popup uh, we are going to import popup uh, also from uh, kv.uix.button not popup but button uh, we are going to just import button uh, also I'm going to use a uh, relative layout so if you don't know about layout management in Kiwi you can just watch my video complete video on layout management so we're going to just import relative layout now uh, the pop-up widget is used to create model pop-ups so now by default the pop-up will cover the whole parent window now when you're creating a pop-up uh, uh, we need to at least set a pop-up title and also a pop-up window. Now, let me just first create uh, my pop-up class in here. Uh, so this class extends from the pop-up and I'm not going to write anything in here and just I'm going to say pass. And also uh, I need to create a class my relative layout so I'm going to just give it like this but you can name it as you wish so now this class extends from the relative layout <clears throat> now in here uh, we need to just create a method because we will bind this uh, in our kiwi so I'm going to just say diff open pop-up <clears throat> and first thing we need we need to create the object of this pop-up so I'm going to just say pops and uh, my pop-up and after this we need to just open this so pops dot open now we are going to create our main class in here so I'm going to just call it class pop uh, app window now this class extends from the app and in the build method we are going to just return our relative layout so return my relative layout and now let me just run this so create my so we need to create the object of our our this main app class that's pop-up window class window uh, pop-up window and now we need to just run this okay now we have written our uh, uh, we don't need this button yeah I think let me just remove this okay now we have created our uh, these uh, Python codes now let's just create our uh, Kiwi now I've already created a file at name of pop-up window dot Kiwi now make sure that your this uh, file name should be similar to the this uh, your class pop-up window Okay, now we need to define some rules in our Kiwi file for this my relative layout. So uh, first, we need to just add Kiwi version, and now uh, I want to create a button in here. And for the text of the button, I want to give uh, open pop-up. So open pop-up, and also I'm going to just give a background color so like this and you can give a pose hint uh, position so for the for the X I want to just give it 0 and for the Y also 0 also uh, because uh, I'm using relatively out let me just give it a size hint 0 0.3 so so it's uh, for it's the uh, size of button so like this and now 
are be on press so when we press the button we want to just open our this open pop-up so let me just make it like this so we are going to just open this diff open pop-up so let me just copy this open pop-up okay now now we need to just create our uh, uh, this uh, my pop-up now we need to just add some rules for this so okay now the ID uh, for for the ID I'm going to I uh, just give it pop and also for the size hand uh, 0 0.4 and also uh, we can just give it uh, 0.4 and also uh, 0.4 and for the auto dismissal auto dismiss I'm going to just give it false because I don't want auto dismiss I want when the user click on the button that I'm going to create my pop-up should be dismissed so by this reason we need to just make this false okay now you can give a title for this so for the title I want to just give it pop-up window okay now after this we need to just create a button in the, our pop-up so for the closing of the pop-up and I'm going to just say click here uh, to dismiss pop-up and on press I'm going to just say pop dot dismiss so this dismiss is related to the pop-up class now let me just run this okay now we have our this uh, button now if I click on open pop-up you can see that we are receiving a pop-up now in the pop-up we have a button so if you see uh, now you can see that uh, in the pop-up my pop-up class we have a button so it's for dismissing of the this pop-up so we can just click in here and now it's dismissed so like this you can work with the pop-up in Kiwi uh, you can just get the source code from my blog and also uh, please subscribe to my channel, like the video and also share the video.